The countdown to Halloween begins, but for some people, the holiday is already here. Grace Hodak took a trip to Sun Prairie where several lawns are dressed up in the spooky spirit. The woman behind these 10 skeletons is trying to build herself a big reputation. This is the um, Taylor Swift debut era. Kaylin McLaughlin says she and her family decorate for Halloween every year, but this time around, they acted swiftly in setting it all up. One day I kind of thought of it. I was like, we have to do this. And uh, my family was so kind to let me borrow a lot of their skeletons. Each skeleton is dressed as a different era of singer songwriter Taylor Swift. This is our speak now skeleton. Uh, this is our red skeleton. McLaughlin says they started getting everything ready back in August. My husband built all of the frames and um, me and my kids uh, painted them one day. In September, I started to collect some of the outfits. I was going around to the thrift shops and looking online, and I was looking in my own closet. Now going viral on social media, McLaughlin says the response has been great. I can't believe it hit 500,000. It's just been a whirlwind. Uh, there's been people driving by. If I'm ever out here, people are stopping to take pictures. But McLaughlin isn't alone when it comes to the Halloween spirit. Just down the road is Aaron Vokin, and when the sun goes down, the lights go up. They're liable to snatch your ankle and pull you right in with them. It's a uh, Halloween exhibit that kind of borderlines between yard sale and Halloween decorations. This is Vokin's third year of decorating in Wisconsin. And I just had the creativity. That creativity brings the neighborhood this. And with an engineering background, Vokin says he builds most of it himself. I found this uh, coffin at a uh, just laying on the side of the road and I took it and then added a motor to it and it's got a sensor on it and so it's got a, a skeleton inside there so I built all that. For him, the setup process starts at the end of September. It would be great if I could just like pull a string and they just all pop up but it doesn't work quite like that. What do your neighbors think? Well, <laughs> I will say they've learned to tolerate it. <laughs> they, um, they think I'm crazy and they think that I, um, you know, kind of have um, just a, a real passion, I'll say, for Halloween. I love Halloween. Um, maybe not as much as I love Taylor Swift, but. <laughs> the kind of decorations where you have to see it to believe it. In Sun Prairie, Grace Hodak, 27 News.